I've been wanting to do this video for so long. It's me reacting to all clips. I'll put his YouTube in the description. His name is Chills. And let's get way right into it. Um, yeah, dude, so. You, these videos will give you the chills. After all, I have what to live up to my name, number 12. This video is brought to my attention on the Chills Narrator subreddit by a user named Ryan Cool Vids. The baby monitor of a family in Michigan catches a transparent figure briskly walking by the crib of their sleeping daughter. Moments later, the toddler's head pokes out to see if one of their parents is in the room, but they are nowhere near. Weirdest and most frightening of all is how you can see the figure literally vanishes seconds after it walks by the crib. What it crosses the? the room and then it disappears before it gets to the doorway, almost like an emotionally charged event destined to repair itself what without the? end. Before we go any further, it's a proven fact that generosity makes you a happier person. So if you're generous enough to hit the subscribe button and the bell beside oh, it, oh shut you. up! Number eleven. These videos were taken at the annual Global Citizen Music Festival of 2018 in New York City. Everyone mm -hmm. is enjoying the late night concert until mm -hmm. a crowd of people suddenly start trying to escape and basically cause a stampede. Nobody knows what they are running from, and they won't find out until much later, but everybody is moving fast and afraid for their lives. Their voices are filled with panic and raw fear fuels their every what step the? as they grab their friends and try to get out as fast as they can. What? I have no idea what's happening. The situation becomes all too real when the head officer of the NYPD comes on stage and makes a brief and serious sounding announcement. <laughs> What the hell? What the... Try to move backwards is all the police will say without any further explanation, which sends everyone into even more of an uproar. Those who make it out find the entrance is swarming with emergency vehicles, what but the... still nobody knows why. As it turns out, the source of the commotion was a large steel barricade that fell over and made a loud banging noise. The bang carried throughout the venue and sounded like someone discharging a firearm, which caused a panic. I can only imagine how stressful this must have been for everybody, especially when none of them know what is wrong at the time. Fortunately, a strong police presence was able to keep the evacuation orderly and help stop people from trampling what? each other. Number 10. Sophie Dosi is a talented contortionist with a twisted sense of humor, so to speak. What? Here she does a crab walk backwards at top speeds with her head barely hanging above the floor. This is a really creative, ingenious way to scare people that I've never seen done before. <laughs> it's a little dangerous, too. I mean, if she steps on her hair while walking like this, her neck could snap all the way back. Maybe I'm just exaggerating, but I think I see it almost happen multiple times as she races down the aisle, which adds a whole new level of fear to the overall situation. Number 9. Not even gated security is enough to stop this complete and total stranger from prowling around people's homes in Las Vegas. Here, he is caught on a doorbell huh? cam while standing outside of someone's door in the middle of the night. What? You can see him momentarily freeze in place, look inside their window with a trance-like state. It looks like he is making an important decision in his mind. He holds a blade with the tip facing outwards and then he turns what? around. For more than three hours, the man roams around the upscale neighborhood, looking for who knows what. And if anyone stops to question... I'm sorry to interrupt, but the... But, but if you guys know what's going on, do they know what the police is, or do they know what a weapon is? Take a baseball bat or a hockey stick and bash him in the head until his death. Just kill him, dude. How hard is it to dodge a boy, dude? Just pretty hard at talking. Can you not talk to me? This video was taken near the Pearl Tower in What the hell? 
Is that fucking Superman in the sky? Thunder can be heard in the distance. It appears people began recording when they saw someone who appears to be levitating or hanging off the tower. What? Suddenly, do you all see that? Lightning, and it appears this person acts as a lightning rod because he's shocked numerous times by the lightning. But the man is fine and stays suspended in midair. I couldn't find any additional information on the incident. What? So it appears we'll never know what happened to this individual beyond the recording of this video. If this video is real, number seven, the local lake is overflowing and freezing at the same time. Now a giant mass of jagged ice is pushing past the shore. Okay. At first, the freak weather is somewhat fun to play in, but as the lake continues to spill over, they realize their houses will soon be in the way of the carnage. The moving mass of ice shards crackles loudly as it continues to expand. First what? past their yard and then up to their front door. Within less than a minute, the situation changes from amusing to desperate. What the? piled up beyond control and an entire lake's worth of frozen water threatens to push the houses from their very foundation within just six minutes the entire landscape has switched from greenery to solid frost i'm guessing they had to stop recording and evacuate shortly thereafter number six mail mail you out here Spectators gaze overhead at a bizarre white light piercing the sky. The Adults and children alike gather in the street with their cell what phones. The? None of them can figure out what is going on, much less put the situation into um. lights. The whole ordeal almost looks like a helicopter searchlight, except that it makes no noise and does not move at all. A NASA experiment or even a portal to an alternate dimension are two more possibilities, however unlikely they may be. Wherever this is, that's a medial. That's a common, dude. That's a common. That has never been properly explained. That's a common, dude. Number five, Randy Doss claims to live in a haunted house and offers this video evidence for proof. I dare you to slam that door. <laughs> They start recording this video after the door opens all by itself, at which point they try to get the spirit to do something else. What? With that said, the ghost seemingly takes up the challenge. Watch the crack in the door and you'll see there's absolutely nobody on the what? other What? No. Just for the record, it's only Nick and I here. Just when the door almost slams shut, this happens. Oh my god, no! Oh my god! Whoa. The obvious answer is that there is a child standing on the other side of the door, but look again. There appears to be nothing more than an empty sleeve, and more importantly, it doesn't make contact with the door at all. This makes me think that whatever forced the door open could have also wrestled the nearby jacket too. Number oh? four, this Iraqi child is unique from her peers in many different ways because her skin and hair have no pigmentation at all, but most importantly, her eyes are pure red. The reason she squints into the camera is because her red eyes absorb all of the light instead of reflecting it. Her parents see this rare eye color as a blessing, but some see it as a curse. That's After a curse. Red eyes are a nearly universal sign of possession in many cultures, though I doubt this is the case here. Some That's possession, dude. She doesn't years. even have pimples in her eyes, dude. That's She has no pupils in her eyes. That's pure... Dude, that's pure possessed right there. Pure possessed. I will never watch these videos and watch if I have to record this, dude. I'm literally... Dude, I'm gonna have she nightmares for this. Understand. Her red eyes will stay this way for the rest of her life and hopefully cause her no social stigma. Number three. This video is also posted on my Chills Narrator subreddit by a username Boys. Whenever they find themselves at this particular highway intersection, their Lexus starts beeping out of control. Okay, this intersection, it always happens here. These innovative cars I've never watched this video before also. Someone is in front of the car. No one is anywhere near them. But here you see both of the yellow arrows are lit, meaning it detects someone straight ahead. Seconds later, you can see the right arrow is on, which means that someone is now moving to the right. I just wanted to stress that this never happens at any other intersections, only this one. What? Boys, this event has occurred four times in the past two years alone. 
With this evidence in mind, this intersection could definitely be the haunting ground of someone who didn't make it across the road in one piece. The hell? Number two, this archive 2001 video becomes even more horrific the closer you zoom in. In the bottom center, the? you can see a poor person helplessly waving at the rescue workers down below. There's little the firefighters can do because the ladders are too short to reach the floor that they are stuck on. I can only imagine can see that? through their minds. I'm zooming in. Now being trapped with nowhere left to go. And you can barely see it, but to the right of them is a it's second right person who is waving just It is right there. I really hope these two were lucky enough to make it to the bottom floor. But if they're trapped on the edge like this... The chances at that point are sadly very low. Oh, it's right there, dude. To watch, what? goes out to everyone who was affected on that day. Before we get to number one, my name is Chills, and I hope you're enjoying my narration. Are you curious? How am I enjoying, I'm dude? Real life? How then go to my Instagram at Dylan is Chillin YT to find out. Do you like my narrations? If you answered yes, then tap the follow button and thank you for your support. To show my appreciation, a different follower gets shouted out every day on the Chills Instagram. Now I also, just. Don't forget I upload a new video here on YouTube. You know what, dude? Who needs a camera stand? Oh my god. No! I'm not even over 11. I'm not even over 10, 10 years and 5 months, dude. The Exorcist is one of the most iconic horror moments in film history. And to pull it off, they had to design this horrifying life size dummy. Forget about Annabelle. This gruesome doll from The Exorcist is so well animated that it's often hard That looks creepier than freaking Annabelle and Chucky combined. combined. Look at this behind the scenes for What? For example. If you told me that this was a real person on the left, I would have absolutely believed it, especially back then. Watching them open up the doll's head and peel back layers of skin to tinker with its oh, creepy beyond all ew. You almost expect it to spin around and bite off their fingers at any moment. The way the doll moves its eyes during this part looks so convincing that I always thought it was a real person. When you consider this movie is from 1973, you'll realize how advanced these special what effects dude? were. They were so good that these scenes still give people chills over 40 years later. And probably for the rest of time. Oh my goodness! What the heck? Now, dude, in my next video, I'm gonna react to this one right here. Okay? Okay, peace. Okay, I'm gonna react to that one right now after this video. And I usually record like five videos a day. Um, I might roll it down just because it's annoying, and yeah, my phone drains so fast, and yeah, see you next time, boys.